Glenda White here with Verity Mortgage, the mortgage coach DFW. This week we're getting it real. We're talking about the loan approval process and what do we have to prepare for? Stay tuned. Hey guys, Glenda White here with Verity Mortgage. And today we're talking about the loan approval process and what does it take to get a loan through underwriting. Um, as a first time home buyer, we understand it's absolutely terrifying. We get those, uh, those conversations all day long of, I just don't know where to start. Or my realtor gave you my information three or four months ago and I just was afraid to do it. First and, form first and foremost, don't be scared. We've been there. We know what it's like to be in your shoes of a first time home buyer. We here at Verity Mortgage absolutely love our first time home buyers. We love to educate. We love to make sure you know what you're doing on a platform that can get you from start to finish. And during the process, we're going to ask for everything from top to bottom. We're gonna ask for your cat. We're gonna ask for your blood type. But we're gonna make sure we do it in a manner that you are safe and secure to where we think that our clients want to be met as well. So how do we do that? What what does a loan approval process look like? So we look at your income. And when we look at your income, it is not just a what's your annual salary because we know everybody's income is completely different. And believe it or not, not a lot of people actually know what they make, how they make it or what their total number is. When we do a mortgage, we're going to ask for W-2s, we're going to ask for your paycheck stubs, we're going to ask for your tax returns. And when we break it down on your paycheck stubs, we're going to see is there overtime? Is there commissions? Is there a base or a draw? So if you're in a commission based income, we're going to ask if you're a nurse, what is your uh, shift differential as well? All of those numbers kind of come out to a different factor. I had a client yesterday that's a registered nurse and you know we just looked at her income and by the time we were done with it it was broken down into six different buckets when you buy your house you're not aware of that that's our job our job is to take your big picture item and take your income and your credit and your assets and kind of fit this box into a house for you so when we talk about credit we talk about your income and your assets don't be scared we need to make sure first and foremost, we're getting all of the information. We are on your side, start to finish. And if we know more information up front, it's going to cause less of a turbulence when we get into the loan file and you actually contract on a home. So for your income, again, we're gonna look at W-2s. We're gonna look at your breakdown of your hourly rate, your draw, your commission, your projected bonuses. What have you done? Have you gotten a raise? Have you been laid off because of COVID and now we have to reanalyze your income? Um, all of those are just a couple of scenarios that we're working with. The next bucket is we're gonna talk about your assets. And when we talk about your assets, it's not just of, hey, what's in your checking account? Because honestly, it's more than just your checking account. It is a 401k loan. It is a IRA, a money market, a stock account. Where did the money derive from? Have you gotten it from someone that you just dropped in a big lump sum? We look at all of those factors when we go through the loan approval and really dynamically see what your assets are. And the next one is the biggest, I think the biggest topic that I ever talk about every day, all day, and that's credit. I don't know how many conversations that I've had recently that agents have called or clients have called and they have previously spoken to another lender and the first question we ask is what's your credit score and what are you going to do to get it a little bit better? They're like, I have no idea. We weren't told that. Well, if you don't know which credit score is, first and foremost, give us a call. We're going to take a look at it. You should always be aware of what your credit score is. I don't fathom the reason of why lenders don't give credit scores out. We're here to make sure you're fully educated. And if you're not fully educated on what your credit score is or why your credit score is different from Credit Karma and My FICO and your Vantage and your credit card, 
then again, we're not doing our job as lenders. So credit is what have you done over the last two years and what have you done in your credit history? We're gonna break it down. Most first time home buyers don't have the perfect credit. Most second time buyers don't have the perfect credit either. But for our first time home buyers, more specifically, what do you have to do to get you there? I had a client yesterday, great story, that she went to another lender, they weren't able to pre-approve her, I got the credit report, all she had to do is pay off a collection for $120. Take a credit score up like 45 points. It's that kind of education that you need as a first time home buyer to feel that you are in the know and you're not on the other side. Um, I feel that in lending, we need to make sure that we're all in this together and we're really in it to get to the final solution and getting a house and getting you into a home and not just telling you no. Um, it may be a no now, but there's solutions that we need to do to get you there. So what can we do on your credit to get you to the most perfect solution so when we get your income and your assets and your credit, we can now present it to the underwriter in a manner of here's here's your information and it's all viable and it's all checked out and it's all it's all in the box to where the box is now a home so income assets and credit that is what we look at for your loan approval if there's anything that you guys need or have questions about we would love to help you out sincerely uh, we are in here to, again, educate you to make sure you know what you need to plan for to purchase a home. I'm Glenda White. We're getting real with Glenda. Verity Mortgage. Take it easy. Have a blessed day.